I sleep when you can play Dom Team Death, the free for all, CTF and sabotage. Man, I play them all from search up to headquarters, down the list of demolition. Objective is speaking to win is my only mission. If I sin, it's not by omission of all. Hey, what's up, YouTubers? Hardcore Gamer for Life here. I bet you're wondering why you haven't heard my voice in a minute. Well, probably most of you have a fairly good idea. You know, it's been Christmas time, and I ended up going out to the in-laws, and, you know, it was cool to go out and get to see them, uh, but at the same time, uh, you know, their internet connection is not of the uploadable sort, really. Uh, it's really, 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 really bad DSL that makes my friend... Nick's DSL look like freaking 50 megabyte Fios. Just like, honestly, I don't remember dial up being this slow. Uh, but, <laughs> anyways, guys, yeah, but it was nice to do, go just go out and disconnect for just a minute, you know, and just chill out, watch some sports on TV. I'm a big sports fan. I love watching. That's like one of my favorites. I like watching sports. I like watching educational stuff like, you know, History Channel and. Discovery Channel and all that kind of stuff, but uh, right now the, the uh, family is in the other room uh, watching the toy. I don't know if you remember that movie. Uh, if you're an old old fogey like me, then you remember Richard Pryor in the toy. Uh, but that's an excellent movie. That's what you might hear in the next room if you're catching little bits of noise uh, from elsewhere. That's probably what that is. Uh, but uh, I'm just doing a quick class request actually from my buddy Scorched Fire. And as you can see, I got the AK-47 rocking. Now he wanted extended mags, which I am rocking here. Uh, but I also went with the silencer. He didn't say any weapon proficiency in particular. Uh, so I went ahead and chose the two attachments weapon proficiency uh, because I kind of require a silencer on my AK-47. All honesty, I kind of require a silencer and kick. Uh, but, you know, I just it, it, was, it was just one of those things where, you know, obviously I'm doing a class request here, so I might not necessarily get everything exactly the way that I want it, and that's fine. Uh, but... In any case, I actually do end up getting what I want as far as that goes because uh, he also requested that I run the specialist kill streaks or point streaks. So, uh, you know, once you build up to your specialist bonus, as I do here later in the round, uh, then, you know, you have all perks plus all weapon prof proficiencies. So, which is pretty darn awesome. Uh, you know, once you get all those weapon proficiencies, you have, of course, kick. So I got the silencer, kick, and extended mags. You know, best of all worlds right there. Now, he's got me using Marksman as my first perk on this. And, uh, or as my first third perk, excuse me, my, my original third perk. My original uh, second perk is Hardline. And the first one being Sleight of Hand, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, Sleight of Hand Pro up in here. So, you know, um, all those are pretty good. Hardline's a real good perk. Uh, honestly, I prefer it to be my third specialist bonus, because, and here's why. You know, um, I like Hardline to be my third specialist bonus for the simple reason that, you know, yeah, it's cool to have it as your first, as original second perk, you know, in a way, because, you know, bam, you've got an Im immediate extra perk, you know, of your very first kill, which is kind of cool. But at the same time, I'd rather have my specialist bonus in one kill from my final perk selection. That's the way I'd rather do it because to me getting two kills off spawn is nothing. But getting two kills when you've already just earned your third, you know, a specialist perk and you know you need those two kills to get up to the full specialist bonus, you know, it's a lot tougher to me than just getting a couple kills off spawn. So I'd rather have as my third perk that hardline. So bam, I get that kill for the hardline pro, you know, as my third specialist bonus. And immediately I only need one kill. I don't need two kills now. I need one kill and I've got all my perks, all my proficiencies. Uh, so that's honestly how where I prefer to use hardline when I'm running specialist. But as I said, don't always get everything exactly the way you want in a class request. Uh, I will say this for future class requests. I love doing class requests for you guys. Don't get me wrong. I'm not complaining here. Uh, but uh, in future class requests, if you do want me to actually do the request, I highly suggest that you do not use a gun that I have already done is in, in good as gold. Because I, I ended up golding out this gun before I got this request done. I, I did it in blue because I've already done it in gold and just wanted to do a little change out for the camo. But yeah, I just... I didn't really want to have to gold out a 30 gun this prestige, but I already kind of told Scorched uh, that, you know, I was going to get this done, this prestige. So, you know, for in future requests, just t take a look at my Good as Gold playlist on my channel. And if I've done a gun on there, probably you don't want to request it because I'm proud. That's probably the one request I'm actually probably not going to fulfill uh, is any gun that I've already done on Good as Gold. Uh, just because, you know, I can, I got to gold out those two guns in, in every prestige. 
And, you know, basically that had me scrambling at the end of my prestige for my good as gold gameplays again. Whereas I was actually in pretty good shape and I could have got them probably before I even had my full XP to prestige. So, you know, I'm, I'm just I'm trying to run through my prestiges as quick as possible. And it's kind of frustrating sometimes at the end of my prestige. I, you know, I could prestige right away, but it's, you know, a day and a half before I do because I'm going for good as gold gameplays. And, uh, you know, I've got my system down where I'm ranking up to my two gold guns and my all pro perks pretty quickly. Uh, but then throwing this uh, extra gun here in the mix that I already had golded out in the first place, uh, it just kind of... Uh, uh, made it so now you know i was kind of ended up having to spend an extra day at the end of my prestige yet again so anyways uh just quick this and that for you guys to let you know uh the best way to get your uh class requests approved if you do have any and uh, i still absolutely do wel welcome all class requests uh you can even request ones like i said that uh, i've done on good as gold but uh i may not be able to get to those anytime terribly soon uh, because I'm just trying to whip through these prestiges and uh, get all these gold, get you know two gold guns per prestige, and adding a third one that I've already done just uh, doesn't work out for me. So uh, let's move on from there, and let's talk a little bit about the rest of this class. Now I'm using a Simtex as my lethal and as my tactical. I'm using concussion. I don't care for concussion that much. You know they really. Uh, I don't know the radius on concussion isn't nearly as much as flashbangs. Which, I mean, is nothing new, uh, but it almost seems like the radius is a little worse than it even was before. And just the throw time between flashbangs and stuns, it's not as different as it used to be. Like, throwing a flashbang used to be way longer than throwing a stun. Uh, but they've, you know, they've taken down to where that difference between them isn't that all that much. And all in all, I just feel like I get more benefits off of a flashbang. And, uh, yeah, so I, I honestly I prefer to run flashbangs. That's what I normally would run in this kit. Uh, but, you know, concussions, they can be helpful too. Uh, it's nice to actually be able to slow down your opponent. I actually prefer concussions more so in a class, say, if I were using a shotgun, uh, which next prestige I am going to finally grip my teeth and gold out my Spaz-12 uh, and get that gameplay. Uh, but, um, you know, basically... Uh, for shotgun classes, I like concussions because, you know, you're always trying to chase a guy down with a shotgun class. And, you know, when you got that concussion, obviously that makes it way easier to chase the guy down. You just throw a concussion, bam, slow down, buddy, rush up behind him and do your dirt. So, you know, I'm definitely going to be using the concussions here this next prestige. Also, I'm going to, I'm debating. I'm going to gold out a sniper next prestige as well. I'm going to go shoddy snipers this coming prestige. So I'm going to gold out a shoddy. I'm going to gold out a sniper. MSR or L18, L118. I'm just, I'm not, I'm not sure what I want to gold out as far as snipers. I'd have to spend a prestige token basically if I want it to be the MSR because you get it kind of late. And I'd want to just basically start on it right away. But, you know, I, there are other th couple other things I would really like to spend that prestige token on. Uh, but at the same time, you know, I don't know. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Anyway, this game is winding to a close. And I am the victor, of course. 30 kills, 5 deaths, none too shabby, not too great. Whatever. You know, uh, here's your class request, Scorched. Glad I could do it for you. And I will be catching you guys on the rebound. This has been Hardcore Gamer for Life. As always, please rate, comment, and subscribe if you liked it. Peace. <laughs> Keep it on the dial where you know that it's hot Cause you know that on my channel I upload a lot of videos Of all different types of varieties Gameplays, mini tasha's live comms, defense and comedy bits Ain't no playlist titled greatest hits Not yet, but you can bet